Hi guys, so Tory MPs aren't the brightest of folk, I understand that. You don't need to pass a test to become a member of Parliament. But Tom Hunt is really pushing the envelope here. Now, he was on Tory-friendly GB News, where in true Brexiteer style, he said, we shouldn't listen to experts because the average person on the street is just as much an expert as any lawyer when it comes to the law. Wait till you hear this that it cannot be referred to as a precedent, as a point of law. OK, OK, there's, there's, there's legal A's uh, interpretations of what happened, what's happened. I mean, there's a common man's interpretation of what's happened. What, what do you mean there's the legal aid's interpretation of what happened and the common man's interpretation? I don't give a crap about the common man's interpretation. We have scientific experts who look at climate change and they have their interpretation of what's happening. I don't give a crap about what the guy down the pub's interpretation of climate change is. I want to listen to the people who understand what they're talking about. And in this case, we had prosecutors, we had the defence lawyers, we had the jury who looked at the evidence and came to the conclusion that these people were not guilty. Now, I don't give a crap about what the guy down the pub thinks. Um, if, you know, ultimately, if I was a radical leftist who thought all statues should be toppled and any statue that I think should be toppled should be toppled, if I saw this case and I saw the individuals in question be properly punished, then I'd probably be not that likely to do it. But if I saw... So you're... What he's trying to do is he's trying to paint a picture that, well, because these people were not punished, that means that we're going to see statues falling all over the place. Well, have you seen any statute following this case? Wouldn't you imagine if this, you know, if he, if he was telling, if he was stating a matter of fact here, wouldn't you imagine that these radical leftists would be waiting for the verdict to come through? And then as soon as the verdict came through, they would be out on the streets, smashing all these statues, tearing them all down. Well, that hasn't happened. Why hasn't that happened, uh, Tom Hunt? saw the individuals in question in a very high profile way be completely let off, I'd probably be more likely to do it. So I, I, I guess there's, there's, you know, what certain legal experts might determine to be legally a precedent and what I determine to be a precedent. <laughs> but you're not a legal expert. <laughs> it's like, once again, back to climate change or apply this to anything. It's like what the mechanic determines to be the problem with my car and what I determine to be the problem with my car. I'm sorry, I'm not in a position to make a statement on this. <laughs> was Tom Hunt at the trial? Was Tom Hunt following the trial? Did Tom Hunt uh, review the evidence? No, he didn't. And he's made an, a, a ridiculous uh, example here of, yeah, well, look, all of these leftists are going to go out and smash all these statues. But they haven't. So you've been proven wrong. Oh, well, we just need to give them a bit more time. Okay, then. But if... People understand that if they go out, there's a chance that they could be arrested. They could be fined. This is one case, okay? It doesn't set, as was highlighted before, it doesn't set a precedent. But this is in this is com makes com this is of complete indifference to Tom Hunt. Tom Hunt has been proven wrong here, and he's still sticking to his guns. But ultimately, I think the, the, the verdict that was made last week will encourage more such incidents, uh, and I think it's very difficult to argue otherwise. Well, I can argue otherwise. It hasn't happened. Like as I said. If people believe, if tr people thought they were going to get away with it, and using your logic here that, well, uh, the, the people who carried out this uh, removal of the statue and throwing it into the river got away with it, then why weren't they immediately following the case, tearing, tearing down all the statues in sight? Well, they didn't, because they know they understand the law a little bit better than Tom Hunt. What a ridiculous <laughs> politician. And unfortunately, people vote for people like this. And he'd be probably voted in at the next election. Hopefully not, but per he perhaps he will.
Let me know in the comment section, guys, what you think. As always, your comments are greatly appreciated. Thanks a lot.